Hello, I'm Deborah Richards from Madison's Residential and delighted to be able to show you the Oast House on Farnham Lane in Langton Green. Well, this is a really unusual property for Langton Green. Langton Green more typified by more modern properties, but here we have a property that was built 1500 to 1600 and the current owners have been here over 30 years. It's a wonderful property, let's show you why. One of the first things I love about this house, it's private lane location. But despite the fact that you are only a few minutes from Tunbridge Wells and uh, you know can walk to nearby Rust Hall, look at that lovely private lane location that it's got. So real seclusion, won't hear another car, all you can hear is bird song. And the front of the property, very, very pretty, tile hung elevations, very much in its original keeping. You've got little enclosure properties here, there's the farmhouse here, which sits just to the left. And then as we go to the front of the property, I'll just take you in through the gate. And you can see you've got this lovely space for parking, there's the annex which we'll have a look at, lovely big rear gardens and the Oast House itself. Well, here we are in the entrance hall of the Oast House. And here we've got a really great area for coats, uh, shoes, great storage space there. And then to this side here, really good little pantry utility room. Nice butler's sink, solid oak tops, lots of good storage space. So heading back out and into the main inner hall, as it were, I guess, of this lovely period property. One of the things I love about this house is it's got such a fabulous flow for a family. So you've got all these rooms that are set off this central area, making you feel very connected in this lovely galleried landing. So even from the bedrooms upstairs, you could stay very in touch with your family. But it's not a small house, only two and a half thousand square feet, so lots and lots of room. Lovely seagrass matting carpet throughout, which give it a really characterful feel and a great wood burner there. And through now to the kitchen. So the kitchen is in one of the roundels and works really successfully. This family are a bunch of cooks. So as you can see, and you can hear gently murmur away in the back there, the, the Ray Bell is 20 years old, but annually serviced by peg room, so in great order. And lovely rafted ceilings. Back door there to the outside, lots of windows, so feels light and bright, helped by that southwest aspect over there. Great sink, masses of storage space, and room for a table and chairs. Heading back out of that inner hall to the left, and we find a dining area. And this is such a versatile house. So when I visited this house for the first time, the dining room is actually over here. But this is now a really great grown up, almost like a parlour feel to it. Lovely little wood burner there again. Second round of this property and great big vaulted ceilings, which are fabulous. And that lovely door to the outside, that terraced area, which we will show you in a, in a little while. So back out to the, ancient, the inner hall and over the way to what's currently their, their family snug. Another lovely space, so cosy and intimate, great storage, perfect size I think, and with views to the front of the property. So back out to the hall again, to the left, and we've effectively done a loop, and now we have one of the bedrooms which is located downstairs, always so useful if you have elderly relatives or guests who want a bit more seclusion. So a really lovely double room. Again, more beams is a great feature. Nice space. And really conveniently located right next door is a great shower room and WC. So that's the downstairs accommodation, so now let's go upstairs. So you've got this lovely stairway that comes down into the main hall, once again giving this great feel of connection throughout the property. 
And the owners have really loved them looked after these properties. They've done lots of what I would call the really boring invisible spend. So made it a lot more heavily insulated, addressed the roof and the roundels. So here we are on the upstairs landing and um, through to this lovely gallery bit. It's giving this great connection. Feels nice and light. You've got some beautiful high windows which are flooding this place with light. And then down this end to one of the bedrooms which the current owners are using as a study, a home office. Lovely bolted ceiling which gives it a great sense of space even though it is a cute little room. Lots of fitted storage again, meaning these rooms are really well designed and practical. And into another of the bedrooms. Really beautiful bead. Creaking boards as you can hear. <laughs> Lots of windows again, and all the um, the Kent head, head tiles have been taken off and insulated behind that. So the house is a lot more energy efficient. Great storage space. And back out to the landing and along to the next bedroom on this level. Really nice little space again. There's certainly a double. Once again, this lovely, heavily beamed, rafted ceiling, which is a feature of this property. The bedrooms aren't huge, but they're certainly adequate. They're definitely doubles, and thanks to the clever storage solutions, a perfect size, in my opinion. And then along to the final bedroom. Another cute little bedroom, takes a double bed, well rafted. And this room, as you can see, has a separate shower cubicle. And then in addition, there's a bathroom just over the way. Really lovely little space. So that's the upstairs of this four bedroomed, one bathroom with the additional shower room property. And now we'll show you outside. Well, here we are back at the outside of the property. So let's show you what's on offer out here. First, we've got a really great little studio annex here. So um, the current owners are using this for their art business. Um, they've got spare prints, as you'll see, for sale. Some budding artist talent in the family. And it's a really flexible space. Over the years, it's been used as a teenage den, home study office. You've got plumbing in there and a toilet, and then down the end, just lots of storage space. So really useful. again well one of the things I love about this property is it's fabulous garden space you've got so many terraced areas uh, useful for different things as you can see there's a lovely archway leading through beautiful memory tree to a uh, home barbecue and that's off the kitchen just there and a really lovely raised area here so for people wanting seclusion and privacy and a rural retreat this certainly fits the brief in my mind. It's a westerly aspect, so uh, great for afternoon and evening sun. And you've got a lovely fire pit here. Really beautiful. And then as we stand forward, you can just see down the garden to lovely areas. Let's just take you for a quick walk down the garden.
And this garden's been a great space. The owners have lived here for, as I said, over 30 years and raised their two children here and found it was a fabulous space for those children to explore and roam very freely. It's a very secure garden. Lots of beautiful rhododendrons, acer plants, giving it real year in round interest. You can hear the birds song almost continuously. And something they're very proud of, which we're approaching now, is their wonderful new addition vegetable garden. This was started literally the week after lockdown began, so at the end of March, and they have already harvested their first radishes. So we've got a lovely little potter's shed there. Great location, which just shows how versatile this property is and how it can really change with you. And we've got a little summer house and some extra sheds. And then a lovely aspect back up to the terrace and you can see the house almost not able to be seen from this really mature and established garden. Well, I hope you've enjoyed our tour of the Oast House here in Farnham Lane in Langton Green. What do I love most about this property? It's difficult to know where to start actually. I think I love its sheer uniqueness for what it is so close to Langton Green in such a lovely, secluded, idyllic setting with so much space around you to enjoy family life. You can tell it's been a much loved family home. It's been really, really well looked after, upgraded and cared for over the years and has been flexible enough to change with the current owner's needs. And they found it a fabulous space during lockdown living. They've even created their own vegetable patch down there. So it's just a super quirky, cool house that gives you everything you need. But what did the current owners say they loved so much about it? It's quirkiness combined with practicality. It's been the most wonderful family home that the children have adored in the most idyllic setting. It provides the most fantastic informal entertaining space both inside and out and it has a big personality. It's cool and soothing inside on the hot summer days and in the winter with the fire burning in the stoves it's wonderfully cosy. A real celebratory Christmas house that cuddles you. I hope you've enjoyed our tour. Do please give us a call if you'd like to arrange a viewing.